Hey YouTube, Laser Shooting Robots return with the part two of our Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles Out of the Shadow figure reviews. A lot of the figures ain't looking so hot. So No, but these ones are looking awesome. They are looking At awesome. At least in the packaging. Mm -hmm. We've already covered the Roxy and he looked awesome. Mm -hmm. so here's next, Bebop. His companion. Um, again, but in the box he looks good. If you didn't like his look in the animated version, this one goes back exactly to what everyone I think thinks Bebop would be like. For modernized, yes, anyway. Exactly. As much as you can modernize someone with those kind of sunglasses and a mohawk. At this Which, from the truly actually reference to, bring back the mohawk. Oh, there you go. <laughs> right? <laughs> so, anyways, here we go. We got the rest of his casemates. Blah, they're all garbage, anyways. The Krang is actually interesting. I, I, I am foreseeing maybe adding the Krang. Um,. Don't bother with the humans. Uh, or the you turtles. Like Splinter the first time around, you didn't like him. You're not going to like him this time because he looks worse. Yep. And, um, yeah, the turtles, either you're going to like the designs or you don't. And I don't think we're fans of it yet. No. No, no they've, they've redesigned them. And uh, the figures, I'm not sure about the movie. The movie, look, they look better in the movie. Yeah. But the figures do not look they better. They didn't translate well. They, I they do not, the updated figures do not look well. I think the first version of the figures look better than the new version of the figures. Yeah. And I mean, until we do an objective review, we'll then never know. But then maybe like, we've been so turned To be honest, I think they should have kept the whole like belt sarong thing on Raphael. Belt sarong uh, thing. No, he like the warrior looked, belt. I know. Uh, it's a lot of thing. place though. It's like where would he find all that warrior crap on? Like where would he look like well, Conan? And I think he can't those... build a belt. There was that too. But, they put they put everyone in warm pants now, so it it's kind of me it me a little weird. Genitals. See, even these guys are wearing pants. No, but just well, they wore pants in the original cartoon. There is but that. this is a thing from back for Rock State. But they made them all wear pants for no reason. I get the other side of Michelangelo wearing like yeah. a surfer gear. Yeah. But it kind of made them look more unique when they all wore like different cell Something. outfits. Yeah, exactly. So Instead of like, oh no, uh, Leonardo was wearing shorts and Donatello was wearing shorts and. Oh, pants! They were both wearing pants. Uh, Raphael and Michael Angelo were not wearing shorts. So, so I can't. I can't maybe just, maybe I can't there were complaints about the turtle nudity. It wasn't really much nudity. No, I don't think so. Unless you can qualify as. Lara was the most nude out of all of them. He had, he had like the Native American like vest the thing armor, on. Bone armor, right? I know. Well, not really bone armor. It's more like the original Japanese yeah. armor thing. But it was just I don't know. So, anyways, yeah, let's go back to Bebop. Bebop, 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 Bebop. Let's get this guy open. Yeah, let's get him out of the box. Again, what the hell just happened? Have we gone into some alternate dimension where Playmates actually applied themselves and actually made something decent for the price point? It's like, we might as well make two good figures out of the line. You know, you like look how freaking textured this guy is. And it's not just the front. It's the back, too. He's yeah. got his back rolls. He's got like his razor back going on. And look, even the... It's like they made at least as a perfect line. They're actually like slightly different and warped. Yeah, exactly. Molding artifact. Who knows? And again, but... same thing where the... A little touch Pants. of the tail. Um, bring on the rock stay for a second. Yeah. Let's go check seven. Nope, they didn't reuse that. No. I was thinking no maybe they reused the width. I know the width is wider. Oh, right. But I was just thinking, you know, no. something they made a cheap Titan and made a little bit of reuse. No, but he's got like different, like he's got like the studded pants, right? Yeah, so, oh, here you go. I was just right. thinking about the actual hip part. Yeah. The oh, pelvis okay. part. Right. But, no, the likeness is good. It's good. Um, I like the likeness. You know, the thing is, is they could have, like, if he actually's got sculpted eyes behind the glasses. Yeah. Um, they're not painted. Of course, this is Playmates. I mean, I would be expecting the moon. If yeah, and actually, the, the sunglasses, but, actually, the slits are actually real. It's not like a little piece of paint black. Nope. And, also, they're rubber. Yeah, oh, they're rubbery. Oh, okay, so you can see the eyes. Yeah. So, again, that's kind of a bummer. But, honestly, I'm not really looking at the eyes too much. Again, what draws your, your attention to it is yeah. the glasses, right? Which he's been known for. Um, yeah, definitely a signature for the character. They actually yeah. represented, let's see, the original one with black pants, black boots, and brown vest. Yeah. Yep. It's yeah. Rocksteady. It's, it's Bebop. It's Bebop. I think the only different one is uh, Rocksteady. Yeah. He didn't have a lot of vests recently. Or gold chains. Yeah. But he had the Brian Camel pants. Yeah. And he had always had the goggle thing. He always had the head. goggle thing. Uh, maybe not, not in the original figure, though. Yeah. Uh, just, he had a, a tank top. Or uh, oh, yeah, like a sleeveless yeah, top, yeah. which the belly top, because they always show his belly, is always, always ripped around his belly. Yeah. That's the original hat. So they didn't keep carry that over. They gave him a vest because they, no. they kind of ride bikes in the new movie. Yeah. But articulation is pretty much the same, you yeah, know. The, the kind of, the, he's got kind of, he's, he's a little different because he's he oh, goes a little more forward. He's got the higher yeah, shoulders. Yeah. He's got a bit of a ball oh, joint. He's a bit of a ball joint there. He's got a ball joint in this one. That's surprising. Actually, okay, I noticed on Rockstar he's got a little bit of a... Well, and he's got the hibble bit. shoulder. He's got the... Yeah. Just a hinge elbow. Yeah. Which, you know, as Don said there, it's the same color as the wrist, but exactly. there's understandable reason why I did that. Yeah. 
He's got the swivel the wrist. He's mm-hmm. got the swivel the whisk. He's no, he don't get upwards when you got belly legless. Nope. Uh, especially not figure. He's got the hivel hip, and he's got the swivel boot. Yeah. And um, hinge knee. This is far more articulation than like his playmates version has. Like for the well, animated his playmates, show. the animated show, yeah, the animated version. Like, and paint details, yeah. He's not the most. I think Rocksteady has more paint detail on him. Mm-hmm. But he's got like the red pin on the arm for the tattoo. Yeah. He's got the pink mohawk. Yeah. On the ridge back. And the little pink piece on the bottom of the tail. Yeah. And the some of the studs here pants, some of the studs in the pants are pants. Okay. And the bone necklace is pants. The teeth yeah. and the gold uh, nose ring is pants. Yeah. And the gold ring is pants. Yeah. Like, like, and this the silver is belt is pants. Because I really thought things like the ring would be not painted. Right? Yeah. Those are things you don't you know, you expect. Like you don't expect it. In the belly button sculpted. Yeah. You got a little bit of I mean, look, look at the texturing of it. It looks great. Yeah, you see like a little scar or something there. Yeah. You, two, two like little scars or something on the side. They're actually molded in, so it's not yeah. actually... So it's not just a... It's, it's not, not a defect, so you actually actually rub along of, there. It's actually molded. Yeah, that's actually part of the um, sculpt. So it's actually, Yeah, part of the sculpt. Um, comes with, let's see here. He comes with a, basically a chain with a padlock. So basically comes with John Cena's weapon. Yep. And a crowbar. There we go. And they're actually sculpted in gray, which is uh, kind of a... It represents actually, what they not are. Bad. This is where molding in one particular color works in your face. Exactly. Um, it's not mandatory, but you know, hey, if you had to skimp out on it, this is a better place to start. Other than you know his companions, um, you know weapons that don't really work in one color. Um, honestly, it it really blows me away that you know I know I'm sounding I'm praising like playmates, which isn't much here. But it's very rare we do that. They they did a really good job with this, these two. I mean, that's the thing. The rest of the line, I don't know. I, I've seen Shredder. I've seen Foot Soldier. I've seen Casey Jones. They look like crap. I haven't seen the Foot Soldiers yet, but I've seen the Shredder and I've seen the Turtles. Yeah. Um, yeah, they're busy peg warming. They're peg warming. And they they don't look great. Um, I guess because the movie's not out yet. But... I th- I've seen The Crying once. Yeah. And I only kind of glanced at them. And mm-hmm. I'm not I'm not interested in band this, this line yeah. at all. Yeah. But I've seen The Crying once. And the like, eh. I'm you not know, interested. You like the designs I'm walking away. But I really liked, I really kind of liked how they really directly homaged the original, the ones that yep. we, you know, from the 80s that we all kind of grew up with. I wonder if so. the crow, I know in the picture they got the crowbar in the other hand. I just wonder if oh. it actually fits better in that Does hand. Does it fit better? Because it was sliding right in that hand. Oh. Uh, I guess turned that way if it's a little better. Yeah. Oh, okay. The hands are slightly yeah. softer in sort of the weapons. Yeah. But you know what? He's actually pretty impressive for a Playmates figure. Like, this is, like, my first, like, I really, really like it. He doesn't have yeah. some bizarre, you know, articulation or anything. He's actually got more articulation than a lot of the animated turtles we're getting in uh, towards the, you know, the recent end of their line. Um, yeah. So, I mean, if you're fans of these characters, pick these up. Yeah, um, they, they I have noticed on my runs, Bebop was actually unavailable first time. I just found Rock City. I'm like, well, what the hell? And then when I saw Bebop, I'm like, I bought it right away because I'm like, at 10 bucks, he's going to disappear. Oh, definitely. And you know what? Uh, the sculpt. The quality is actually not that bad. Now, if only yep. they used their powers for good and applied this to the rest of the line. So he's got the Hall of Feet. Yeah, they do. I think where... even Rock City. Yeah, Rock City's got those two. But you know what? It doesn't impact it. No, it just makes it just makes the figure a little lighter. It does. As kind of affects uh, see if the price point. It would be nice if they had the solid feet, but yeah, uh, exactly. Okay, but you they... know what? As long as he still stands and looks yeah. semi decent, I mean Exactly. You got a thumbs up in my book. I may end up hating the movie. But you know what? You still love the figures. I'll always love these two. Ah oh, well you're going to see the movie theaters anyway. Yeah, exactly. Nice if you're not you're getting dragged along just like the first one. Dragged, kicking and screaming. Well everyone, uh, thanks for tuning in. So have a good YouTube channel, we'll see you again there. I'm not